is that guys and welcome back to another video on the channel full time at brisbane road swindon one leighton orient one we've got um a point away from home against top of the league it's a massive achievement i'm really happy with the point and i did get my my prediction right so i'm happy with that so um yeah like i just said full time swindon one leighton orient one we were one nil down i was expecting it we weren't looking very good in the first half it was on the 12th minute from a corner into the far um went into the far post and Omar Beckles was there at the right place at the right time to slow it in to make it one nil. And then on the sixty fourth minute we did get an equalizer. It was from uh Jacob Wakelin. It was assisted by um Rushnet by Murphy. It was a um through war I think it was and then uh it was a one v one one between Jacob Wakelin and Lawrence Figaro, our former goalkeeper. He did actually get a hand on it, but um, didn't matter. Still went in the bottom right corner and we made it 1-0. So, did we deserve the draw? I I don't know. In the first half, I did think that we were a bit dodgy. There was nothing exciting going on in the first half. And then in the second half, that's when we did come to life after um, our first and only goal. They had uh, Leighton Orient with a better sign, in my opinion. And it was shown by their uh, possession. They had 56% possession uh, compared to our 44%. And then they had 11 shots altogether compared to our eight. And four of them, four of them, both at Orient and Swindon, were on target. So now, after the um, Orient-Swindon game, here's the lead table right now. Orient have um, now 11 points in front of Carlisle, who are second. And Swindon are six points off the playoffs right now. We are sitting 11. And um, we think this is a hard game right now. Next week, we've got to play Carlisle, who are second. So it's not... It's not getting any better for us. So, um, according to Fotmov, the highest rated player on the whole pitch was George McEachern. I did actually watch the game on the iFollow and um, I agree. George McEachern is outstanding in that game, both um, in attack and defence. He was good and uh, I think he got a yellow card. Yeah, yeah, he did get a yellow card. Uh, but that don't matter. He was good today and let's hope he can carry on the, um, like what he done today. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I never expected the first goal from Swindon to actually happen. First half, nothing really much happened. We didn't look like we were going to score any time soon. And then the sec start of the second half, we weren't looking that good as well. And then, um, obviously, if it weren't for Jody Morris' decision to get Wakelin on, we wouldn't have scored that goal. We would have lost and we probably would have been 12th, I think it was. So, so guys, that is the end of another video. If you did enjoy this one, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. One, the road to fans and subscribers. And it'll mean a lot if we do reach that. And thanks to WLG for sponsoring the channel. If you do want to check it out stuff, um, go in the link in the description. And if you do want to buy some of that stuff, make sure to use code G19 at the checkout. Anyway, that's all from me. See you in the next one. Not to do. Ciao.